And it's on! <laughs> oh, you got my balls! Hello guys, so today I'm testing this little guy. I put it on the MiFi Nanojig prototype. This is a 800 size reel, it's 116 or 117 grams. Uh, it has very very thin line, this is 3 pound fluoro, it has some backing with a 4 pound braid. Uh, we'll try to catch something, I'm on the creek that I usually fish, but today I will be wading it. I'm not very confident in here, but the main river is full of people swimming today. So, I will try to catch something in here. If not, I'll maybe try to go on another section of the... Oh, it's cold! <clears throat> and it's on! Hey, stop trashing! Decent size one! Whoa! Stop it! I don't think I think this through. was not supposed to get these bigger guys, but good thing I got him. Pretty cool sized chub. Sorry for the, the fanny pack. It's all that I brought today. They are, s even in the summer, they are very, very slimy. Could this be a nice thumbnail? Pretty colors on the fins on this guy. Let, let's let him go. Let's try to take the fanny pack of the way, it's not on the camera's way. And I go further down on the creek. So very very shallow. A uh, lot of cover on the side. Perfect spot for this tanta. But I cannot really see any. Now I saw some sh shadows. Sorry for the noise. Some rich guy is cutting his grass. Actually telling folks to cut his grass for him. Ah, short str again. Man, this rod, I know I'm not using <coughs> on its true purpose, which is 
vertical jigging but you I can tell the difference from the you see here bite I can tell the difference from a even a, sh a sh whoa it's not the same guy it's a smaller one but trashy come to daddy yes another shove on the creek <laughs> let's quick release him <clears throat> so I don't know about the durability of this reel <clears throat> I was very biased when I opened the box because this is plastic and I really hate plastic handles even though this one doesn't flex <clears throat> and I, I know why they made it plastic because they wanted to make a very very light reel because this in here it's aluminium it has some sloppiness on the on the knob but the most important thing it works I just wish that right now it was cheaper because I think now it's $30 or something like that and if it was like 20 And you really want a very, very light combo. So right now this is, so 117 plus 60, 177 grams, which is actually quite amazing. And this one also balances very well with the rod if you hold it like I do with just the pinky under the real foot it, it it feels like you're holding nothing like holding hair so actually pretty pretty cool combo <clears throat> i just wish it was lighter so first wading session of the year and it's july usually i start on april but the weather was oh i see i don't know about you guys but i'm very very satisfied with the evolution of my fishing game so i'm doing this for two years now I've been fishing my whole life but for carp and for barbell on a float where you just do some uh, I think it's loop knots where you have the loop to loop on your and so I had to evolve my uh, knot game I would never <laughs> have the confidence to come with trip online uh, and this is a special trip online. This is Sogelang fluorocarbon that cost me one cent on AliExpress. If I can be bothered, I will even put the print screen. There was some error on super deals and they put a bunch of spools. I think I, uh, the three and the six pound, I have a bunch of them. And yesterday I was putting 0.4. Um, Point for uh, P, and it was not enough to put the enough uh, line on this reel. So, recommendation: if you catch this reel very cheap and you want one, get the 500 size. Don't get the uh, the other ones; it's not worth it. Just get the shallowest spool possible, because you'll have to put a lot of line. And I have plenty of confidence on my knots right now. 
Let's try to go a bit further so I can fish near the bridge. Man, good signs. You see there? There's grass. There's salad, which means the bath that we saw may hide here on the winter. So I think all the fish went up the creek, uh, only small ones hiding on the sides. I'll go down the creek, I was not supposed to fish the creek, I wanted to, f there's a small one nibbling, I was not supposed to be fishing the creek. I was supposed to be fishing the main river, but there's a lot of people there and I don't want to be the the douchebag throwing hooks near kids. From people that I don't know. So, if I wanted to catch the fish that are looking at my lure right now, I would have to downsize even more because they are pretty, pretty small. I think I'll pass the bridge. Hopefully the creek will not dry with these poor souls in here. There's a pool there, right before the bridge, with all that, those logs. I really want to put my lure there because I s think that there's some... Yes, bigger fish in there. First try. Exactly the same spot. Just a quinky dink, the guy run away from the line. Oop. Hit it. Just one question, if some older gentleman are watching why do I don't know if it's a Portugal thing I don't know if it's a trout thing why does everyone say that I should fish against the current and I always only have success fishing facing the current uh, I think I put it wrong so I'm fishing down the current and every time an old guy passes it will say hey, I should fish facing the current not with your back to it why I only caught fish I think other than parallel uh, retrieving my lure against the current, so... Uh, <clears throat> Let's go through the portal. Yeah, a lot of small guys in here. Man, I really wish I could catch a sunfish. Oh, nice dam over here. Try to not kill myself.
so this is the place where you see me catching all the fish during the autumn and winter oh you got my balls uh, cold as if actually on this size side of the creek it's still deep i think i fished during the spring from ah right right on the pipe saved it oh nice open area with current nice so this is where i lost all my lures Something is on, probably pretty small, yeah, pretty small guy. Ah, Jesus. Nice <coughs> small guy. Okay. Let's release him. So I just saw that I've missed one guy. The camera will not show, but basically, I missed this guy passing my line yesterday. <coughs> so bit of a doofus move but since i don't see any big fish i will continue to fish and when i reach the main river i will fix it are you sure about that i guess i'll have to fix it now why I don't fish with Floro. See you guys in a, I would say bit, but. So this is basically my mistake. Going on the pocket, because you, sh you shall not trash. So I went all the way up the creek with no luck, going up against the current as usual. And in one of my last casts, I saw some fish activity and I just uh, did the old retrieve near the bottom displacing some dirt and some sand to try to entice the chub to bite. I feel some short strikes but other than that I even adjust my drag preparing for the little fellows and the little fellows are following my tanta. Following, following, short striking, and following, and done. Gotcha. Come on, the water. My combo is feeling refreshed. Ah, so, 
another one on the tally. And with that last fish I started to go up again on the creek and thinking what I would say on the outro of the video, which is about now. I'm here on this beautiful location on the waterfall. Uh, now a little bit different scenario than the winter. Uh, finally I can wait, it's already July. Uh, last year I started to wait on April, but we have to do what we have to do so only now i could be able to wait and i was testing the north pole uh, spinning reel the 800 size actually pretty competent i've drenched in it water it didn't uh, failed miserably um, like some other reels as soon as they touch water still working still smooth uh, i still think that it should be cheaper now it's like 30 euros or something like that this is a a 20 maybe 18 20 22 uh, it's pretty cool for this sort of application uh, ultralight drag works perfectly I had no probably problem managing fish with three pound uh, fluoro the other thing folks don't be stupid like me uh, I put 0.4 uh, braid, never saw it today. Uh, just get the shallow spool if you really want this reel, the 500 size. Um, because you should be running braid and not straight full oral. I had some problems with the line memory when I was casting. But still had a blast, caught some fish and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye!